Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to part eight of Let's Play The Old Realms for the Lady I Fight, where we are currently finally at war. We've done our first battle and we're now in our, well, what's going to be our first siege of the campaign. Um, we uh, The battle was a bit weird. We had to leave and then join again, but uh, yeah, it was good. It was a good battle. It was a very fun battle. Um... Lads, it'd probably be a good idea if you just pulled your, um... What's it called? Also, the fact that I can use, like... The fact that I can, like, set my sword alight is really cool. I know it's not for that long, but it's still cool. I've also just realized I may as well go push the goddamn, uh, Baden Ram, because I don't have any, me like, ranged weapons. Alright, dude. That's one of my fucking grail knights. Uh. Alright, we'll get this to the wall and we'll uh, bow that wall down. Whoa. Well, that wasn't good, was it? We got hit by a big thing there. I do apologize about the slow reaction. I'm so, I was uh, just turning off something to make my room a little bit less warm. Holy shit, is it warm in here right now? Right, let's buy this ram. I've lost three men. I've lost three Grail Knights specifically. Damn, that sucks. As soon as we get through, though, we'll absolutely massacre them. I guess you can't really do holy that I was thinking, yeah, holy damage, but yeah, I guess you can't really do holy damage to a gate. But yeah, I need to level up my two handy because one of my skills does like one of my uh I can I can enhance the knightly vow with two-handed weapon with, with scale it with two-handed. We need to use two-handed a little bit. Why the Jesus? Why is our men like? Oh damn it! Men, push better. You, oh, you guys are sucking. Fuck. Watching my men die makes me want to cry. The fact that this dick has just sat outside doing nothing is very annoying. Oh, no, no, no. We're not sending my fucking men in. Fuck you. You wankers can go in.
Actually, I'll take the Knight Errands. The rest of it can fuck off. I'm just trying to recruit Knights at this point. I don't want a castle, so that's fine. I want the first settlement we take, though, I'm definitely going to try and take. Uh, well built, yes. That's right, give it to someone but me. Now this, I'm going to take myself, I think. I just gotta hope this one goes a little bit better than that our last one. It's like they he's like he's building them and just thinking, yeah, these won't break. Immediately breaks. Hmm. AI is not the smartest man in the world. Where is the ballista? Down there. Yeah, I'm gonna take that over so we actually have someone useful on it. Because I sure as shit do not trust the AI. Get off it, bud. Come on. I don't even know how to aim this. What the hell? Uh, that? Luckily didn't hit me. I mean, ballistas are cool and all, but like, this feels like the most useless weapon in the world. Yeah. I'm gonna just, I'm gonna go and use the barring ram because that feels like I, I, that feels like I'm less of a target than anything else. So let's just, yeah, let's uh, let's use that. You know, we'll uh, we'll keep you there because you'll be you're draw strong. Hang on a minute, fuck that. I go help there because that actually looks like it's about to get there. Well, that broke. Who knew? Oh wait, everyone knew. It's like it always breaks. Yeah, not having a uh, ranged weapon in a siege feels really goddamn weird. I don't like it. Well, I take it the men aren't going to get a climb up there then. They very stupidly don't start trying to get up there until it's already open. That's uh, not intelligent. Oh damn, this is a problem. Alright, let's try and two-hand this. There we go, come on. If we can wait another 30 seconds, we can use our Grail Vow again, or a Nightly Charge. And try and, you know, give ourselves some boost in damage and whatnot. Not that I actually know what the Nightly Charge does. Or what it even enhances. I just know that it makes my sword glow and looks cool. That's literally like the only important thing. It makes my sword glow and that's all I need to know to know I need I need it. Uh, four men have died. Oh my god. Yeah, there we go. Swing the fiery swords of 
the lady. Holy crap, yeah, we are not getting... Like... Yeah, we just can't get... Like... Just can't get through them as well. Also, does my nightly vow... Does my, does my um, nightly charge heal me? I'm pretty sure I was damaged. Let's see if I can survive until I can use it again and we'll see. Because we're definitely damaged, so... You guys get out of the way. Did you just fucking die? You twat. 11 seconds and we can use it again. We just have to survive until then. Five seconds. Come on, we can do this. It does heal me. Oh, that's awesome. I didn't know that. Does that mean it also heals all my allies too? No wonder we needed to level up our two-handed just so we can scale stuff with it. There we go. This is we've lost 13 because we all my hard work of all those troops I leveled up. Just, like these sieges are just killing them. Okay, let's use sword and shield now because I haven't really used sword and shield that much at all. I say my sword and shield's garbage. Oh, you ass why? Right, how do I get back up there? That's the real question. All right, there's some stairs here. Cool. Yeah, we have lost a lot of men in this fight. Oh, shit. Yeah, I like that's a slow sword right there. I am better at using my two-handed sword than I am this one at the moment. Wait, I got this. There you go, lads. I need to look what stuff skill scales with what. And then I need to start trying to train those, I think. Like, Nightly Vow seems... Sorry, not Nightly Vow. Nightly Charge seems really good. Oh, there's a lot of troops in here. Yeah, not having magic or gunpowder makes the battles really long. Oh my god, they've got actual fucking soldiers again. No! Men, defend me and I can heal us. The lady protects. She doesn't protect for very long, but damn it, she protects. They killed 500 of my men. Ow, I thought I died then. How have they killed so many? Oh, wait. That amazing thing called catapult. Yeah, not having a bow or something, or like just some throwing weapons, just. It really does, like, feel so weird doing a siege, like, completely opposite of what I normally do. I am not used to just running in and just being a part of the melee. Ah, let's go on. For the lady. I mean, if we look at this, I've leveled up a lot of sprinting, a lot of one-handed, a lot of two-handed. Like, I'm just trying to level up my skills as best as physically possible. All right, I'm going to quickly retreat because I don't want to do it. I don't want to go to the keep. So I'm just going to send my men again. Another fucking Grail Knight gone. The pain. I feel it.
It hurts. This settlement, depending on how good it is, should be mine. This should be mine. So damn, we have like no money. Also, yeah, that okay. We do have a lot of stuff though worthwhile, which is good. So like we will have some money in the soon. It'll take a little bit of time, you know? Right, so I leveled up my one hand in, so let's get Swift Strike. We leveled up this, let's get form fitting armor. Yay! Do Olivia. That means I, I make some money now, right? Why are we still attacking? Our army's so weak. Um, I don't really want to do another battle. Son of a bitch. I've played so much today. I don't want to do any more. Oh. But give you the Knight of the Realm bo boots. That's a good point. I have Questing Knight armor, but Knight of the Realm stuff looks different. Right, um... Guess we'll attack, why not? I did want war. I, I mean, I did want war. That is, uh, that is true. We don't even have a battering ram. How the hell will we get? Are we literally relying on ladders? Because I'm not going to lie. That sounds goddamn stupid. Yep, that's what we're relying on. We're relying on fucking ladders. Oh my god. Cool. We have a prophetess though. Oh. Wait, what? The f What? What's she doing? How is she getting all these kills? I mean, yes, I know she uses spells, but like... How? Like, even Vampire haven't been get going to get kills that quick. Yeah, I don't like... No, 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 no. Oh, that, that. Oh my god. There we go. Yeah, I'm probably gonna get killed doing this, but screw it, I don't care. That was fucking rude. Going up the other ladder. Just, no one seems to push people off this ladder. We need to kill a few people. That's all we need to do. We just need to, we just need to not die as well. It doesn't help that my um, my the swing speed on my weapon is uh, like for me I am slower than uh, a lot of people because I don't really train one-handed or two-handed very often. So. Yeah, we need to. Uh... Oh shit! I thought I had allies on both sides. Nope, I. Apparently my allies on my left side, on my right side died. Wait, I thought... Where are my allies going? Are they just dying or something? Yeah, I'm about to get knocked out with... Yeah, I'm say, I was about to get knocked out whether I like that or not. Even more troops dead. Uh. 
as they say, war, what is it good for? So in all fairness, we have grown quite a bit. And we're still trying to grow. Guys, we need to chill. Like, you need, you need to stop. You know what? I am actually going to leave the army and go do my own thing. You guys can do this on your own. I'm going I'm going to go over here where uh I have a like a castle and I have people who uh, love me. Uh oh, workshops already level 3. Fuck yes. Uh damn, like most of the good buildings are already done. Uh so let's get orchards and then granary. I put money in, but I really don't have the a money to spare right now. Uh, yeah, we'll sell, we'll sell horses. I mean, I don't really need horses. So that is actually fine. All right, we'll sell that and that. There we go. And then we'll sell you. Um, wait here for a little bit. The dark moon rises. I don't know if they're actually going to get that fort, but all right. Uh, let's, uh, move over to there so I can get some more men. Traveling merchant. It's always worth looking at a traveling merchant. Uh, Bretonian sword. Our sword is technically much better. Sicilian noble. I do love the. Ar I do love that armor. It looks so fucking nice. Um, unfortunately, it doesn't have anything I want. That's not true. He does have this, which means I can um, give that back to you. I get the black and yellow one, and I can sell that. And I can sell this to essentially um, only pay the bare minimum. You know what? Just give me them all. I'm also just going to sell the people in my inventory. I know that sounds really bad, but yeah. It's just easier than um, messing about, you know? It also puts me back to my full limit quicker. Okay, they're sieging. They're trying to siege us back. That's fine. So let's go see if there's anything we can do about it. Uh, yeah, we probably actually could stop them, to be fair. Yours is not a face I know. All right, let's do this. I'm gonna beat this army up first, and then we'll end the war. Seriously, not what I... Okay. That's a very different type of scheme, but okay. Oh, yeah. After we do this battle, we'll have a look at the nightly vow on that so we can understand it a little bit. Okay, so the nightly vow is whoever's near me gets it, right? Yeah, doing a night battle is really hard when you just have that blazing light in front of your face. And you dickheads are sat at the edge of the fucking map. I hate you so much. You pussies. And I can't see shit for dick over, so that's really great. I may have to pull my men back, because I don't think we're going to be able to do much. Oh, shit. There we go. Ground light down. Now we got this. This fight's going to be fine. It's just, uh... Well, I can't see shit for Dick over here. That's the problem. But we'll just spam the, uh, great, uh night charge and... I'm pretty sure it, I'm pre I need to make sure that it heals my troops, not just me. Because if it heals my men too, we've got like a little he uh, heal, which is really nice. Alright, guys, pull the fuck out. Pull out. I feel like I've just lost more men by pulling out. Alright, you're charged. Yeah, I think it's the garrison that's losing troops, though, not me. Yeah, it is. Garrison losing troops in a problem. Mostly because they're not my garrison troops, so I really couldn't care less. That's not true. Olivia does. Olivia would would care. Olivia. Oliver. I'm just gonna call him Oliver. 
I keep trying to say the, if I keep trying to say in the French way, it's just gonna sound like I'm saying Olivia. All right, so we are uh, Antoine, Antoine, Antonia, Antoni. Lebel's party is about to be destroyed. Ow! How dare! Stupid mad at arms. Go on, lads, you just finish him off. Oh. Well. Lovely. Yeah, I'm not going to waste my time getting prisoners. I'm going to go quickly sell these prisoners as well because I need any money I can get right now. Having an all cavalry party is goddamn expensive. Oh, Castle, uh, Carcassonne are sieging their ca uh, big castle. Good for them, I guess. Right, so let us sell all of this as usual. So I like the shitty shit stuff as well. All right. Um, sure. We'll, uh, we'll peace out. Why not? We definitely took a lot of damage there. Three successful sieges, no successful enemy sieges. And uh, yeah, we didn't get the new castle, but that's okay. We're going to unfortunately probably have to cede that to Carcassonne. We're going to have to take it from them instead. But yeah, we now have a castle, which is completely not the mine. Sorry, we have a city, not a castle. Um, let's go and finish recruiting um, the, our numbers again. And once we've finished recruiting our numbers, we will go have a look at... Uh... Right, let's go back to the castle. Uh, sorry, Chateau. Uh, right, so let's have a look at the Grail Vow. So, the night charge mounted on foot for the next six seconds. On mounting the knight receives perk buffs as well. 10% chance for his lance not bouncing off. The cast slash attack increases by 0.01 running on foot. Okay, so, uh, knight charge grants 20% resistance. Okay, I've got that one. Um, during the ability, all healing affects the horse. Okay, so. Uh, so, 20% plus speed. Uh, basically, as a faith, affects nearby allies. Okay, okay, so, oh, holy, okay, so it's the Grail Vow. So, okay, we want to, we want to get an Eru, we want to get that one, then we'll go for that one at last. We also need to do, we actually need faith skills. So let's actually go level up our faith. We will trap. Yes, yes, yes. You will trample us. Blah blah blah. Actually, that's not what I was gonna do. Men, go, go stab them. I need to actually. I need to double check what they actually scale with. That's what I was meant to be doing. Is seeing what they scaled with, and I didn't do that. Instead, some fucking ongors attacked me because I wasn't paying attention. Absolute slaw, though. I must admit, I do prefer the black and yellow bard into the uh, blue and green. Definitely mow my color black and yellow. Wait, is it blue and green? No, it's not blue and green. What the, what's the green one? The green and... Oh, it's green and yellow. Uh, Sure, I'll take prisoners. Why not? Take all that so I can sell it because, uh, yeah, money's gonna be a problem for us, definitely. Okay, we, we received a sink. Yeah, we need to, uh, we need to put some skill points in faith, it looks like. 
Um, but unfortunately, guys, we're actually just going to have to end this part here. So I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did enjoy, please do follow me on YouTube. Leave a like, leave a comment, leave a share. But most importantly, guys, stay safe. Have a great day. Join the channel memberships if you're interested. And I'll see you all in the next one. See you guys then.